In today's video, I'm showing you how to change the ACF fluid. First, we need to place the chopper lock and safely lift the vehicle and place the jack stands. As far as I can tell, changing the ACF fluid in this vehicle will be the first time ever since I am unaware if other vehicle owners have done it or not. We're going to need the oil basket, penetrating fluid to loosen up the tight bolts, and aluminum foil to make sure the fluid drops into the right location. After letting the penetration fluid do its job, we're going to loosen the bolts from the rear to the front and let the oil slowly drain out. Then, we can remove all the bolts and remove the oil filter. At this point, you need to clean the oil pan and magnet to ensure it is 100% clean. Place the gasket on the pan and install a new oil filter. If you're not sure how much oil to replace, pour the oil in an old bucket and replace the same amount that was taken out. Luckily, this vehicle needs 5 quarts which is exactly one bottle. Personally for me, I prefer to use OEM parts and fluids. Just like how my friend says, it's Mopar or no car. The final step is to pour in the new fluid. Since the oil pipe is in an awkward situation, I decided to use a two step method with the funnels. Now, you can turn on the vehicle, wait till the vehicle warms up to operating temperature, go through every gear and make sure everything's just good, then go on a cruise to make sure everything is perfect.